In the morning light, I gear up my flight Got my sub 250, gonna take to the sky Oasis Fly 30, you're my wings tonight With every Scotty Squads and welcome back to another review video. Today we are taking a look at the Oasis Fly 30 frame. That's right, the 30. One of my favourite drones of 2024 was indeed the Oasis Fly 25. So when Oasis, or Sub 250 sorry, reached out to me and said, would you like to check out our new frame? I jumped at the chance. They did send it to me for free. They haven't paid me for this. They won't see this video before you do and everything within this video are my own thoughts, feelings and expressions. And if I can just really quickly thank Newer, we are now in our new studio space and I hope that the quality of the videos will continue to improve and impress. We've moved into the new studio space, it's going to make making videos easier, quicker and hopefully better quality. So thank you very much Newer for that. So the Oasis Fly 30 is a three inch FPV drone. The wheelbase is 150 mil. You've got the top plate thickness of two mil, the bottom plate thickness of 2.5 mil, uh, the arm thickness of two and a half mil. Recommended would be the Sub 250 Red Fox A345 amp all in one. And obviously that's your flight controller and your ESC. The recommended motors are the 1404 4500 kV motors, which interestingly are the exact same motors is on the Oasis Fly 25 2.5 inch quad. So it's going to be really interesting to see if that extra half an inch will make all the difference when it comes to the performance. Is it going to perform the same as a 25? Let me know in the comments down below. I'm not sure how different this is going to be to the 25. We're going to have bigger props and they recommend the HQ props of uh, 3x3x3 which I think is a great great prop for this quad. Um, it's going to be an interesting one like I said they've only sent me the frame to be fair so it's going to take me a while to get some parts together to then build it into a quad to then fly it to then review it so it's going to take me a little bit of time I'm afraid um, but it's, it's certainly an interesting one they recommend uh, a lipo between 5.30 and 7.30 Mar 4S. Uh, will it still come in at under 250 grams is the question. I think it might. I think it should, but it's going to be close. Um, and will it fly any different or any better than the 2.5 inch version? The 2.5 inch version genuinely blew my socks off and was one of the best quads I've ever flown. And I, and I genuinely mean that. Will this be any better? Will it fly the same? I really don't know, but we've done an unboxing. We've shown you what you get in the box if you buy the frame. The quality, as always, with everything sub 250 is without any question whatsoever. It's all there. It looks really nice. We'll get this built up. We'll get it made into a drone. We'll give it a fly and we'll come back, hopefully before too long, with a complete finished drone and we will show you what we think of it and we'll give you a proper review. Really quickly, big shout out to the members, Barry Morgan FPV and Jedi FPV. If you want to join them on the members bench, you do get early access to some content. You get exclusive access to behind the scenes content and you also get your name or channel shouted out in every video that's over seven minutes long. Please do drop a subscribe, like, comment and share this video with your friends. And until next time, I'm Quads. You're amazing. Peace. Landscapes living out a dream. With every twist and turn, I'm breaking.